A community is coming together tonight after a flood left Austin Town's Upper Room Ministries Church in need of repairs. The parishioners are stepping up to help. First News reporter John Rudder shows us how the small congregation is overflowing with support. Typically, the sanctuary at Upper Room Ministries is filled with joy and prayer. But now the droning of fans and dehumidifiers replaces the sound of hymns and songs. The first thing I did was cry. A leaky pipe coupled with a clogged drain created the perfect storm, flooding the basement with three feet of water. Actually, the water was so clear he stepped right into the water. Since then, Steve and his wife Diane Zavolinsky have been busy assessing the damage. Cabinets have already been ripped out, and a new furnace and hot water heater are likely in need. The couple estimating the damage upwards of $40,000. We thought we were going to be totally covered. We had no idea that because of a clog, that that would limit our insurance. So the couple is turning to the church. Where else? For help. Doing some of the demolition work themselves. It is what church is about. We're a family. We, um, we're, we're the body of Christ and we help each other and we love each other. And this truly is what it's all about. The small congregation, about 40 people, is having a massive impact. We're going to do this as a family and we really believe that this is something God's going to bring us together. Staring adversity in the face and just days away from Easter, upstairs remains unaffected. And for the Zavolinskis, they're counting their blessings. We're blessed, really, because for our church and the people in it, we shouldn't have been able to come back from this. But I see we will. I know we will. Reporting in Mahoning County, John Rudder, WKBN 27 First News. Hi, everyone. I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.